Yo, what's up guys, Tavares Media here back with another video, and this is going to be a continuation of my previous video, showing you guys how you guys can make your own custom assistance with ChatGPT. This is so hectic right now that OpenAI was literally like, it just had a huge major outage, literally like an hour ago, and I could even get on the website. So this is pretty hectic right now, so I want to make a content for you guys, and it's really awesome because you can use all of these models, literally like almost all all of them which is really cool right you have 0613 0613 gpt4 you also have functions where you can code into functions right which is pretty cool uh you can do get stock get weather so i'm pretty sure this is um for like api calls and such forth and um yeah it's pretty awesome guys so again you also have other things so let's let's just do this let's look right into it right so you can upload files as well so we're gonna try doing this i'm not sure so by uploading files, you enable the assistant to use the content from these files for retrieval and code interpreter if these tools are enabled. So let's look into this, right? So create a thread. Okay, let's. I want to look into. Um, I want to go ahead and look at the upload file. I'm not sure if those are the databases, but it's very simple, guys. All you have to do is just click create assistant. Let's just name this um, M A A M M A Gym assistant and then you just type it into the prompt you say you are an mma gym assistant that will convince customers into buying fighting classes you will inform them on the fighting topic and digressions and objections so pretty much we just made a lead qualification bot so this will be great for it you know people are saying like oh ai is dead AI automations are dead bro you just gotta join the war you gotta join the fire join the fight join the dark side you know so we have gpt4 i'm pretty sure this is the new model and um gpt4 is always gonna be the most powerful one so um yeah let's go and talk to the bomb like hello i'm looking to book a fighting class for my kid Let's see what it says. If this actually works, that's going to be pretty impressive. So let's see how it responds. It's going to give us the response right now. Null in progression. Okay, boom. All right. Great to hear that you're interested in booking a fighting class for your child. Martial arts training can be incredibly rewarding experience for kids, helping to build the confidence. Yeah, that's good. That's right. That's pretty impressive because MMA and being a kid is very taboo and shit it actually responded i would have thought oh well we can't give this kind of information because like he's a child which is pretty impressive so it says at our gym at our gym that's really good so it's actually imagining as if it's in this is really impressive guys this is actually very impressive right we offer a variety of fighting classes suitable for children karate taekwondo our experience before you decide would you like to bring in your child for a tree okay this is actually really, really impressive, guys. Be like, why should I go to your gym and not others? See how it responds. Give it some time. This is really impressive, guys. Like, this is actually impressive. The only thing that I'm actually interested in is I actually want to see the API on how to actually, like, deliver these. Because one thing is building the bot, but then how do you actually, like, you know, integrate it into your website and such forth. So I want to see uh, tools, code interpreter, whatever, supportive files. Okay. Um, knowledge retrieval. All right. Let's see how assistance work. I want to see if there's anywhere. We already know how to create the system. We already did it. I mean, look at that. It's it's already doing amazing. Choosing the right gym for your I'm glad you consider out making an informing decision. Here's why our gym stands out. Might be the best choice for your child. Expert instructors. Our instructors are not skilled martial arts, but also trained to teach children. They understand how to connect young students and adapt their teaching methods. All right, so yeah, this is really impressive, guys. You guys can't give up, bro. You just got to think outside of the box. Like, join the fire. Join the dark side. If you have to use this to create bots, whatever. I mean, look at that. It's already pretty much done. All you need is API functionality inbuilt and then obviously integration handoff, which I'm trying to figure out how we can actually hand off the integrations, right? Because we created the bot, but how do we actually like integrate it? Let's see. I mean, if any, if I don't think, I don't think they allow it yet. Maybe they integrate into like an API and then you do it through that API call in terms of your private key or something. 
or I don't know. I'm, I'm not sure, guys. If you guys do know how to do it, let me know so I can make a video on it because I just found out about this literally because it just came out. Um, API is in beta. Literally, it's in beta. It just got released. So uh, we can check out here. All right. Let's see. Revenue share, blah, blah. Oh, wow. This is, this is pretty active. All right. Well, if the ever 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 if it ever comes out, then I'll definitely do a video on it. But yeah, I mean that's it. Like the bot is working amazingly there, right there. Like that's pretty impressive, guys. Like honestly, the things like people can't give up on AI automation agency. Like you just have to think outside the box. Like people are not gonna be like businesses aren't gonna just be like oh I'd rather just go here and just try to make my own bot. Yeah, it's super simple. But as I said in my previous video, knowledge is power. And people are going to businesses who have actually lots of money. Maybe smaller businesses might think outside the box. But businesses who have, like, let's say enterprises or mid-enterprises, they do not have the time to go into OpenAI, make an account, sign up, and then try to figure all this stuff out. They would rather spend $5,000 to have someone else do all that for them. Because once you get to a certain level about money, money isn't the issue anymore. It's all about time. And they're trying to figure out how to save time and save money, right? Yeah, they could build it themselves, but it's to a point where it's not even worth it. The time is more outdated. It's the time is more out leveraged than the money is, right? So they, at this point, they'd rather save money instead of time. Um, it's save time instead of money.